Students will often ask, is the putting stroke a pendulum-like movement? And I'll tell them, yes, absolutely, because it usually gets them moving the putter correctly. However, it is and it is not a pendulum-like stroke. The good part about the pendulum concept is that the movement is in an entirely vertical plane, so the club can be relied upon to bottom out at exactly the same spot every time. Imagine the result if this croquet mallet moved in any direction than that of the target line. Only straight to straight can guarantee that a ball moves towards the target, just like in to out, out to in or any other direction to any other direction really cannot. When both hands are placed on the grip, the arms, shoulder blades and spine form a single unit whose design involves some amount of rotation during the swing. The idea is to minimize the amount of rotation so that the putter remains on the target line for as long as possible. Even this small putt has some amount of rotation. Unfortunately, the pendulum has only one fixed spot at which it bottoms out. Our human body, when used correctly, can flatten out the putter's arc of approach to the ball and give us a far better margin for error. The commonly used rock the shoulder concept has a fixed bottoming out position much like the pendulum. The MGSS putting stroke however greatly increases a golfer's margin for error in terms of both the as vertical as possible plane of putter movement and the as wide as possible bottom of the swing arc.